Okay, my butt. Talk to the uh, go to the Jal Jalbert brothers. Oh yeah, Jalbert brothers. Balbert Jalbert. Attention passengers, the next red line train to West Roxbury will be arriving in. Are you coming or? Oh, you're tr fucking trapped. This way, this way a bit. Come on, this way a bit. There we go. Nice and easy. Lemon squeezy. So so far, I think it's ni quite like, quite nicely written. Is you know these these DLC size ones, the, the effort people put into them are usually quite astonishing. I've usually always got some such high hopes for them. You, you you don't really get ones that aren't really all that good. You get DLCs that aren't all that good, but you don't get DLC size mods that aren't all that good. Or at least my opinion. And you also get to choose a powerful perk at the end of Kit's story. That's pretty cool. Oh, it's patch black. Kit is now your companion. There are some differences between her and the vanilla game companions due to the... Okay. Kit's radio in your item inventory. Under aid, you can control Kit's combat still falling distance and... Okay. While acting as your companion, Kit will notice things that you say and do, not while playing through a story, but also throughout the vanilla game. Okay. It's uh, a funny system used a four-way <laughs> Hold up. She, she will have feelings about what you do say beyond like, dislike, love, or hate. These feelings will be reflected in her dialogue. For fuck's sake, slow down, please. Oh, you know what? Bollocks. I'll do this myself. I'll figure this out myself. I don't need your very quick... Uh, uh, what do you might call it? Help there. So yeah, that is a thing. Uh, there's a lot more depth in the like, dislike, uh, things like that. It's oh god, you'd have to just sort of read the description because I don't think I'm really going to do it any kind of justice about what I'm I'm saying here. But it's 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 pretty cool. You can call, call it directly to your uh, location. Uh, current uh, the, the, the default prefer melee prefer ranged. Uh, aye, aye. Oh shit. Falling distance and falling style. Aggression level. I think we'll just leave it for that. Leave that for now. Right. So that is us. We're off to Jalbert. The Jalbertsons. <sighs> okay. Oh, it's still dark. I took that tree mod off, by the way. Just in case it affected anything in, in this uh, mod. I, I want to try and do some kind of spooky thing. You know, Halloween coming up and all. But I don't, I'm not I'm not 100% sure I'll be able to. So just in case, you know. Intact transmitter relay. Right. That looks like it should work. There's just one more thing we need to get. There's a radio station southeast of here. Get to the was station. We have vacuum tube. I'm pretty sure uh, one will be there. I've gotten plenty of vacuum tubes. I'm sure they're everywhere. All right, what's closest? Uh, Shaw High School. Sure, we'll just go for Shaw High School. I've odd. Oh. You know, in case anyone gets this far in the video, uh, what do you think of the Outer Worlds? I'm personally really, 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 really enjoying it. And I may actually record a little bit of it. I know a lot of people may not watch it because of spoilers and things, but, you know, I'll just record it a bit and then just release it. But there's also an Xbox 360 game that I got that I'm really enjoying. Um, um, and uh, I'd like to record gameplay of that from the beginning. Just, uh, just to shake it up. So perhaps I may do that. You know, you should hurry up a little bit. Yeah, like I said before, with when I when we came into that station, there is a little bit, a little bit of lag now and then. Don't have the key. Oh. 
This won't take long. <lacht> oh. Okay. Oh, wow, it, it, it didn't take long. He didn't even go near the door. Oh, she's amazing. Search the radio station. Bottle cap mine. Bottle cap mine. Not that I even use bottle caps in here anymore. Almost done. Oh, you're Almost a different person. I thought you changed clothes. Wait, up ahead. Who is that? That's a librarian, a librarian dear. With empty shelves and books on the floor. Why, that's a pigsty. And nothing more. I guess we better talk to him. See if he's going to get in our way. All right. Um, <laughs> you're a nut job. Are you okay, Mr. Hat? Books on floor, not all right. Books on shelves, quite all right. All right. A place for everything and everything in space. Uh, okay, hi. And welcome to the Boston Public Library. Your weapons. Ah, so many weapons. Leave them at the door, if you please. Because no, man, this is murky. To, or not. Okay, what's going on with my screen? Yes, indeed. Everyone could do Wait, a li this is a shitty kind of library. Six, or seven. Or eight thousand more books. Oh, yeah. This guy's not insane at all. Nope. We're looking for a vacuum tube. Like, for an old radio, do you have one? I like the old style of... of, uh, the dialogue. It's not like the suggestive, you know, positive, negative, that kind of shit. You're in a radio station, after all. Oh, no. No, 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 no. See, I don't believe in that sort of nonsense. Radios. Gonna put us librarians right out of business, you know? I tossed every bit of that hogwash into a locker. Out of sight, out of mind, out of time. Locked it up tight, too, of course, so the radio waves won't infect my brains, or my books, or my books on brains. We don't have time for games. Ooh. Just give us the key to the locker. A key you need's the key. Or his books and brains. In good time for games. Going to get anywhere with him. How about I smack him over the head with something? A book. Well, uh. reasoning with him. All right. Are you gonna? Oh. Oh shit, the okay, case is going away off the screen. <laughs> Looks like he's having trouble with some books. Ask about that. Just approach gently and listen. Right, I'll give that a try. Maybe he just needs help with something. So, about that key. Do you think you could help us out here? No, but I simply don't have time, you see. So many books. So little interest in your problem. Sure is a nice library you've got here. Do you, uh, need some help getting it up and running? A fellow bookworm. What if it burnt down? Yes, yes, I could do with a fair bit of assistance. I must make sense of this mess before the grand uh. The people will want books, not messes. And those I need are the most important books of all. The classics, every one, scattered on the floor in twos, threes, and fours. Just carefully place them on the shelves, and whatever you need will be yours. Well, I guess... Oh, collection... Mm. I'm collecting books for this. Started shelf, I find the Norn burn books and place them into the bookshelf. <sighs> Right. Okay, so I'm gonna place them. Uh, oh, so I just take. I thought I had to just actually pick it up. 
Here we are, here we are. Alice Adventures one also is, is pretty cool. It's all the, the real... It's all real books. Burnt, burnt, burnt. Ah. Ah. Moby Dick. How rude. Uh, oh, I'm gonna do the transfer thing. <laughs> okay. Uh... Look at all this shit. I assume it would be in junk. Oh dear lord. It is not in junk. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes! Oh, awesome book collector. I am awesome at book collecting. None of you out there can do it better than me. Right, you? Hey. You weirdo. Once again. Are the classics back on the shelf right where right. they belong? Better than yes. Dewey himself. One shelf huh? down, two to go. Two shelves Who did down, you call me? Three Who to go. Who did you call me? Four shelves is madness, and this madness has got to go. Here you are, and off you go. Feeling a bit tired now. Time to rest. Okay, I don't want to see Hammer again. Uh, there we go, we got the God, tube. You're here. Seem you didn't quite make it as far as the ocean after all. <laughs> hey, librarian, help us! Throw a book at the guy. No. I'm just smiling. Wait, I'm smiling like I. Not given instruction to speak. Were you? <laughs> like, who's your friend? He seems nice. What does he want with you? I'm afraid your questions will go unanswered, Waster. Because Waster, she is a machine. A and machines cannot respond to questions which they have not been instructed to answer. She's a not person. All machines oh. machines are born of metal and modules. Some, like this wayward herald, are born of flesh, blood, and obedience. And when men march into the fields to match one against the other, I have seen with my own eyes which is the better to have in one's employ. Then you'd better answer me, you piece of shit. By my betters. For now I have come only to reclaim possession of the weapon standing before you, which you unlawfully possess and no doubt irresponsibly command. To try and delay us or complicate my objective would be unwise, as I do not favor your chances of success. Who are you people? We are the Shrank, devourers of the world that was and bringers of the world to come. To know more now would make us enemies, far sooner than the appointed time. Judging by gun, I doubt she wants to come with Yours you. Yours is the world of doubts, Waster. Ours is that of order and stricture. Doubt my words if you like. But for Eight your man wretched sake, I hope you can believe your eyes. Harold. Lower your weapon. <coughs> now, turn around and face the vagrant sitting behind you. That is your target. Now, Hi. approach the target. Oh, the lo oh the oh, I can't feel sorry for this guy now. No growth in the field whose soil runs thick with decay, and neither shall be found a place in the world to come for a man whose blood runs empty of purpose. Stop saying come right his now. time has ended. And with it, just turn the page, him. Find the hero. Oh, he's demented anyway, he's not gonna notice that bullet. Raise your weapon. So tell me, Outlander, 
Does any part of you doubt that when I instruct the weapon standing before me to fire, that it will do anything but comply? <laughs> I get it. You're... Surprising perspective from an outlander. Indeed, we have tarried too long as it is. You see, kid, doesn't it feel better to do as instructed? To it's be another one. Instructed. Oh, I'm sure you've been enjoying this little game of yours, but now it's time to come home, don't you think? Is she a clone? Kit Kat? Oh, Kit Kat, here? okay. Your sister is here because that is my will. And having not taken leave of her function, she complied as dictated by her purpose. Perhaps you should meditate upon her example as we journey back to the territories. Perhaps also pray. And if you are yet righteous enough to be heard, then let us hope the priests will remember the considerable investment you represent. And think better of destroying so valuable a weapon. Our time in this rotting shack is concluded, Waster. Stand aside. <laughs> Thank you aren't taking our period. So be it. May your body, as it rots, nourish the soil of the world to come. So Stop saying that. You will have carried out your purpose. Heralds, for the shrike. Shake. <laughs> then you. Oh, oh fuck, sorry. Our keeper, our path through chaos, the homeward star. What will we do now, sister? Nothing. What will we do? Damn it. Please, don't. Hey, hey, oi. She's helpless. Please don't hurt her. She's helpless without Alec. Alec. Hey. Cat, listen to me very carefully. You don't belong here. Go home. That's all you have to do. You know the way home. I know you do. And I know you can get there on your own. Go west through broken rock. <laughs> Go west. Keep moving until you see the gates. She'll be all right. Oh. It's just, let's just get out of here. I'd just... It's a long story. For another time, maybe. I'd just like to get this stuff back to Symphony Station. And to check on Agnes. Please. Okay. Well, that was a bit of fun there. <laughs> it was nice meeting your friends. Uh, just hope you don't have any many more of them. Uh-huh. Hmm. And we've got the parts you needed. Well, that's just wonderful. Now, Kit, I must ask you to run downstairs to old Alfred's workshop and make sure those parts will work. Just to be sure it's all in good working order. We can't hardly be too careful, can we? What? Right now? Please, Kit. She, I think she wants to be alone with me to tell... Uh, me stuff. Fine, I'll be back. Now then, darling, I must be quickly before I go dark again. All right. No, darling, I'm afraid I really am not. I am broken, plain and simple. I guess you could say that the good folks at oh. Corporation. Put one hell of a battery inside me, but couldn't have been bothered to design a memory module worth a scratch. There are long stretches where I can't even remember the name they gave me. Or where I am. It... It's a dark place. Like I'm out of my mind. You mean, when did I start losing my mind? Honestly, darling, I couldn't straightly tell you. It's been lonely down here. No windows, no sun, no telling day from night. Time's been easy to lose. When Alfred's battery finally gave out, well, that's when things really went south. At least, 
could tell me the date and time when I asked. I believe the last date he told me was... It's getting so hard to remember.